Hey, this is Ryan from Web Eminence, and in this video, I'm giving a quick walkthrough of Google AdWords Express. AdWords Express is a simplified version of AdWords that's easier to use, but it doesn't have all the features of a regular AdWords account. In this video, I'll show you how easy it is to get your ad up and running in AdWords Express, and I'll also show you the advantages and limitations of using AdWords Express. So after you've signed up for AdWords Express, and log in, you will land on a page like this and it says, let's create your first ad. So I'm gonna go ahead and click the button and show you the steps you go through. So you can target by distance from your business or by city, region, or country. So you can type in regions or you can target by distance. So I'm just gonna try by distance. If I scroll down, it says 15 mile radius. So I can just drag this to 20 miles or 25 miles. It tells me the potential reach number of people per month. I'm gonna go ahead and click next. Then they ask you to define your product or service. So I'm going to uh, offer web design. They have their set category. So after you type in the service you offer, you just need to find one that fits. So I'm gonna click on web designer. Choose any other ones that might uh, be appropriate like pay-per-click management. Click next. The next step is writing your ad. So here you're gonna type in a headline one, headline two and description, and type in your web page address, which will probably already be entered for you. You can read some of the help documentation provided up here for more um, tips on writing good ads. And then over here you'll see the preview of your ad, how it's gonna look on desktop. So I'm gonna scroll down and click next. The next step is adding a phone number. You probably will want to do this depending on your business, but it is optional, so I'm going to leave that blank for now. Then you can set your budget. So it looks like they allow you to set a daily budget, and it's giving you um, a per month maximum. So this blue range here is giving you an idea of what your competitors are paying. So you probably want to stay in there in order to get any decent click volume, but go ahead and choose something that's... Uh, within a comfortable budget for you and you can always change this later so it does give you an estimated reach based on your budget so it's telling me 55 to 94 clicks and calls per month these are just estimates so i'm going to click next and it brings me to a review where i can review my ad the location the product and my budget and you can click edit on any of these to uh, tweak the settings and then click next and that's all you need to do. So the last step here is checkout. And since I'm just doing this as an example, I'm not going to enter any checkout or payment information here. You can enter a promotional code if you got it in the mail. And don't forget, you're only gonna be charged when someone actually clicks on your ad or calls your phone number. I'm gonna go ahead and click next just to see what the next screen is here. So it's saying congratulations, the ad is approved. Uh, or it's going to be a, approved in the next 24 hours and you can continue to the dashboard. So this is what a dashboard looks like uh, and this is where you'll find all your ads and you can activate and in, in, uh, set them inactive. I'm going to go ahead and click on one of these ads so you can see what the dashboard looks like for an ad that actually received some clicks. And this is a client of mine who was using AdWords Express for a while. So you can see for this period you had uh, over 4,000 clicks. So it shows you the number of views you had on different devices and from different sources. Also the number of clicks and then the search phrases that actually generated clicks on your ad. And if I scroll back up to the top, you can see you can edit the business hours. So you can schedule your ads to show certain hours of the day. Here I can edit uh, my ad that was already approved. And then going back down to search phrases, this is a very important because it shows you which phrases are generating clicks on your ad. You can see here um, there's a very general uh, one word phrase, which is just tile. So one thing you can do in AdWords Express that many people may not know is you can actually turn off certain phrases. So the way you do that is by clicking the manage button and then just hit this little toggle switch here to turn off certain phrases. So you might want to do that with terms that are maybe too general or are generating uh, a lot of views, but don't seem to be getting you any uh, phone calls or prospects. So I'm going to click done and go back to the dashboard. You can see the number of uh, click to call actions that occurred. So this is people in mobile clicking on the call button, which generates a phone call. 
Uh, here's map actions, people clicking on the map, and then here's the dollar amount spent over this period of time. Then if I continue scrolling down, um, there's my budget. I can change that. I can change the location targeting and then change my product or service. So with AdWords Express, the keywords that are being targeted are all based on uh, the product or service that you've entered in this section here. So it's very important. And then you can fine tune it by removing uh, key phrases uh, like I mentioned before. So you can see it's pretty easy to get an ad up and running in Google AdWords Express. If you have a Google business listing already, you can check out my other video on setting up a Google business listing um, if you haven't done that yet. And for those who are interested, I want to show you real quick uh, why using Google AdWords is a better option for many people and some of the features that you're missing out on if you're using the simplified version of Google AdWords Express. So right away when you look at the regular Google AdWords interface you can tell it's a lot more complex um, and obviously that's one of the benefits of AdWords Express is that it's much more simplified so you can get through it really fast. There's just a lot more features here that's going to give you a lot more control over your advertising, which is going to usually get better results. So one of the first things I'll mention, and I'll only mention three things, uh, is that you can easily create campaigns in ad groups, whereas in Google AdWords Express, you can just create ads. You can create separate ads, but here you can easily create multiple campaigns with separate budgets and location targeting, and then divide that into ad groups. Uh, each of which have different keyword uh, groups that you're targeting. And speaking of keywords, that's one of the most important aspects of regular Google AdWords that's going to be an advantage to you over using AdWords Express. In a regular AdWords account, you're actually going to be adding the individual keywords that you want to target. Rather than just adding your business or service or your product or service and allowing AdWords Express to just choose keywords on its own, you're actually able to select the keywords and add them yourself. A regular AdWords account is also going to give you a detailed search term report, which is going to tell you which terms were searched that generated uh, impressions and clicks on your ad. And it'll give you a lot more detail than what we are seeing in AdWords Express. AdWords Express will give us a count of how many calls were generated, but if you use a regular AdWords account, you can go to uh, conversion tracking. And that's also going to allow you to track things like calls from ads. Uh, with this client, I'm tracking every time a contact form submission is made. And you can also track things like uh, when certain pages on your site are, are visited or when certain actions on your site occur. So conversion tracking is super important for running efficient and productive campaigns, you're not going to be able to really track conversions uh, in Google AdWords Express except for just the basic call tracking that they give you. So there are obviously a lot of other features that I'm not showing you in this video in a regular AdWords account, but the point here is just to show you that there's definitely features in regular AdWords that you're going to get above and beyond using AdWords Express. AdWords Express is easy to set up as you saw in the beginning of this video, uh, but hopefully this video allows you to determine uh, if AdWords Express is going to work for you or maybe you need to upgrade to using a regular AdWords account to get more flexibility. In most cases, if you're spending a couple hundred dollars or uh, over a thousand dollars, it's going to definitely pay off to use a regular AdWords account in order to be more efficient with your ad spend. If you're interested in using a regular AdWords account but you don't have the time to learn it and you don't want to manage it yourself, you might be interested in my pay-per-click management service. You can check out the link below the video if you're interested in that. You can also subscribe to my YouTube channel to check out some of my future videos on Google AdWords. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video.